Hey guys, Justin Bryant here from selfmadesuccess.com. In this video, I'm going to show you a website that has lots of online programming slash coding jobs that you can do from home and typically have some that are available all the time. So right now, for instance, as I'm recording this video, they already have like three or more available right now that you can do remotely, meaning you can work from home you can pretty much do most of your work on the computer and it's related to some sort of programming and coding. Um, so if you have a good knowledge of that stuff, of course, um, this is the type of work you can find that you can do from home. So first off, what you wanna do is you wanna to go to a company called Code Academy. So if you go to Code Academy, um, like here's the home page here, then you can see that it's uh, a way for learning to code. People teach you how to learn uh, how to code and it's a very in-demand skill and it'll probably be even more in demand in the future as things become more and more automated as technology continues to grow. So it's all about learning to code. And if you want to check out their job section, all you gotta do is go to the very bottom to the footer of the page and click jobs. And that will take you to where they have uh, different jobs available. So you can see that they have it, you know, divided up into a lot of different um, areas like design, engineering, things like that. You'll notice that there's a location right below each job and if you want to do remote, one of the things that will have a lot of jobs is the learner support section, as you can see right here, which is above the marketing section. So they have Code Academy Coach Advisor, Code Academy Coach Project Reviewer, and Content Contributor. And that's just right now. They, by the time you watch this video, or if you rewatch it in the future, they might have more jobs available, and I'm sure they will. Um, so this is a company that gets a lot of traffic. It, it's big on teaching people how to code. So here are a few of the jobs that they have currently. And as you can see, they provide you with benefits as well. You get things like uh, medical, dental, and things like that if you get on full time. Of course, this is the jobs page again, but they do um, medical, dental, vision insurance, and paid vacation, days off, wellness reimbursement, things like that. So as far as the actual jobs, uh, here's one called a Code Academy Coach Advisor. And some of the things you'll be doing are defining student goals, reviewing coding topics one-on-one. -on -one. Basically, you're helping people learn to code, guiding students to additional resources available to deepen learning capacity. You're helping students debug code and pass tricky exercises. You're motivating and encouraging students and working with fellow advisors to support and track student progress. Um, other things, you might, you might be monitoring uh, Slack channels to facilitate peer-to-peer -peer conversation and answer technical inquiries, serve as a mentor to provide high-touch personalized support to learners, um, assisting the team throughout screening process to identify new talent, including resume screening, the written test, etc. Skills and qualifications. So uh, you need to be passionate about programming technology and teaching. And if you're watching this, I'm sure you already are. Comfortable with a fast paced environment and with change, highly responsive and accountable, demonstrating strong written and verbal communication, good ability to explain concepts. CS background or demonstrated proficiency with most of the core skills they teach. Familiarity with Code Academy platform, which is strongly recommended. Also, make sure that um, wherever it says in the particular job description, um, they might not be hiring people in certain states, and you do have to be at least 18 years old to work with them. So keep that in mind as well. You got to be 18, you got to be working in the uh, states that they talk about. And a lot of their jobs are part time, although they are still remote. So you may not have a full time position, which means you can also have, you know, another full time gig or other part time gigs or whatever. You don't have to do this full time 40 hours a week. 
So that is a Codecademy coach advisor. That's one of the types of jobs that they have or that you can do from home. Another one is a Codecademy coach project reviewer where you will um, you know, do a lot of the same things as the advisor um, and you'll do one-on-one -on -one chat sessions like for on-demand instruction with the learners. You'll be monitoring the Slack channels to coordinate peer-to-peer -peer conversation, answer technical questions, serve as a mentor um, with personalized support. You'll be doing like video sessions and, and uh, pair programming, recorded video seminars, things like that. And uh, you'll also be assisting the team throughout the screening process to identify new talent like you were in the other one. Um, so again, you need to have a passion for programming, uh, a uh, CS background or demonstrated proficiency with most of the core skills, et cetera, et cetera. It's fairly similar, project reviewer and the advisor. They're both uh, Codecademy coach type positions. And again, this is a part-time remote position, this one in particular. Again, if you check this later on, you might find some different jobs available that you can do from home that might be full time. And then that's when they start giving you more like benefits. Um, and then another one that they have available right now that you might look for if you want to work from home does not mention uh, at the top whether it's part time or full time. But at the bottom, it does mention that here it says it's part time remote position and um, this is a content contributor job. So, you know, you'll write things that help people learn. You could, you know, contribute content and you'll be producing supplemental learning content to be consumed by Code Academy's global community of coders. You'll be working with the learner op operations and curriculum teams to identify opportunities or problems to address with new content and then with writing lesson plans to cover those topics. You also help the learner operations team to build and perfect the process of making content for the learners. You'll also be helping to maintain and iterate upon our growing library of video content. So other things, hosting an educational section with the learners in live stream format, maybe uh, helping students with their coding questions live or whether in written chat or even in video form or collaborating with their design and video production teams, uh, things like that. You'll be helping with the curriculum basically to sum it up for uh, people trying to learn how to code. Um, so what you'll need, passion for uh, the world of code, comfortable with fast paced environment, responsive and accountable, demonstrate strong written and verbal communication skills, comfortable presenting technical concepts in front of groups, professional level proficiency with many of the core skills you need to be good with things like html css javascript python etc um, if you need to brush up on some of those things for free i would recommend an app called uh, solo learn and it will really help you with pretty much anything that's kind of what i've been using to try to learn to code and it's great it's for free you can get it for your smartphone i think you can use it for your computer as well but it's called solo learn all one word and then uh familiarity with the platform of code academy code academy rather uh, is also strongly preferred again part-time remote position so right now it's mostly part-time remote positions but they may have some others in the future um, of course, you can apply for the job using LinkedIn or filling out this form on any of these pages, of course, and they make it fairly easy for you to apply. If you want to learn more about the company, I would recommend Glassdoor.com. What you want to do is go to Company Reviews in the menu, type in Code Academy, all one word. Go to Companies in this section and then click Search. And then you can see that they have a 3.9 out of 5 star rating from people who have worked for them, which is very good, definitely above average. They were founded in 2011 in New York, New York in the USA. They are education training services in that industry, again, teaching people how to code. Five, uh, 50 to 200 employees, they're still a private company. So 
you can read through the 22 different reviews, see if they're worth working for. But as far as the average goes, just under four stars is pretty solid for um, an overall review of people who have worked for a company. And if you want the latest online jobs, uh, maybe you want to look at other things besides just coding, you can go to selfmadesuccess.com. Of course, I'll have a link to this uh, particular page, the show notes for uh, this video, which will be related to Code Academy. But if you want the latest online jobs where you can work from home, that what's available like right now this month, uh, you can go to the online job section on selfmadesuccess.com in the top right corner. I embed the videos in a playlist if you want to see more from the uh, full description of all the jobs there. Then I have uh, a description of each job when I posted it and links to the job itself where you can apply the careers page of the company and more information and reviews from their Glassdoor page for each of these jobs and then at the bottom I have a list of tools that you can use to help get some of these jobs again uh, solo learn is a good one if you want to learn more about coding for free without having to pay anything uh, pretty much every major coding language is on there programming language whatever you want to call it and uh, they teach you through games through uh, quizzes through uh, small bits of information you get um, like little awards for completing courses on how to code uh, you have like an online community where you can ask people questions in like a forum type thing they have all that stuff within one platform so that's so we'll learn and these other things will help you find like your typing speed your internet speed stuff like that that will help you get certain jobs so that's it for this video. If you thought this was helpful, please like and subscribe so, so I can create more videos like this for you. Also, if you want to let me know what you thought about the video or share something you'd like me to cover in the future, let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear from you and get your feedback. And again, I'll have all this stuff on the show notes page for you. Uh, if you want more information about these jobs at Codecademy, if you want to do some programming and coding jobs, and I'll also have a link to that page in the video description for you. So other than that, I hope the video was helpful, and I'll see you in the next one.